one of the UK's rising young stars of the fashion industry and renowned for his passion for print and textiles is the understated designer Jonathan Saunders. The Scottish-born designer began by graduating from the Glasgow School of Arts in 1999, receiving his Bachelor of Arts in Printed Textile. He then went on to gain his Master of Arts with Distinction in Printed Textiles from London's Central St Martin's College of Art and Design, completing it in 2002. It's quite a kind of fine balance between design and fine art approach to textile design. So it was that, you know, whether it's textiles or product design or interiors or whatever you do, it's still that kind of artistic approach in that the print is the focus of the collection. Since then, and despite being fairly new on the fashion scene, his collections have gained praise from across the industry. But aside from coordinating his own label, Saunders also consults for some major fashion labels in Europe. What makes Saunders, a new generation designer award winner, distinctive is how he works with print, colour and not least the cut of his outfits. He is a traditionalist. Instead of using new technology, his clothing and every print is created by hand. Using silk screening techniques, he designs prints around pattern pieces, creating an individual effect on each garment, giving it its own specifically designed print, instead of having the same image being used on each piece of clothing throughout his collections. He was one of the highlights of the London Fashion Week in early 2004, calling his autumn and winter collection a homage to pop and fine art, continually making breakthroughs on the business side of fashion. It's a service at the end of the day, you've got to provide um, a product that people want and it's got to be delivered on time to the shops, it's got to be a good product, so that's the kind of the main importance behind what you're doing and you can get the creative side out, you know, whatever which way you desire. He continued to catch the eye with fresh, bold colours in his next collection in 2004. The Bauhaus influence from architecture, originating from Germany and Art Deco of the 1920s and 30s, were the main themes. But dramatic prints have always been his keynote, whether he preferred the strong reds, oranges and blues, or the simple contrast of black against white. His hemline length varied, while the full-length dresses looked eminently wearable. Only a couple of years out of fashion school, the Scottish designer had already created a significant business, with stockists taking his designs from Harrods in London to Neiman Marcus in the US. By 2007, for the spring-summer season, he was offering military-inspired clothing, which kept him on the path to success. Designs included short-sleeved shift dresses, panelled with contrasting printed binding, layered with breastplates. For day wear, cotton, silk and organza separates were bound with white Georgette to frame the body in a palette of white, cornflower, blue and orange. A year later, he was parading body-hugging clothes with his trademark bold colour panels. His main palette was white with offshoots of black, beige, various shades of blue and a hint of yellow. Like many up-and-coming young trendy designers, Saunders is now mixing with the rich and famous and designing outfits that are now seen across the world on the bright young music, television and film stars. Fashion icon and actress Sienna Miller showed off her look and desire to stand out in Saunders' futuristic looking dress with bold bright colours. And actress Tandy Newton has also been seen wearing his designs and supporting the designer backstage. Saunders is now a designer that's in demand for his own collections, as well as for his collaborations with other British designers. And at such a young age, he already has an impressive reputation, with print being his guiding light since his student days. Using a combination of fine tailoring with vivid design, the understated Jonathan Saunders is one of the bright lights of the fashion industry.